So today I'm gonna make more ribbons. This cutting machine really helped me. Hi guys, welcome to our new vlog. If you're new here, my name is Nico, owner of Nisha Collections, and I sell hair accessories and some dresses. It's been a month since I uploaded a vlog. I really miss doing vlog. From the past few days, I've been so busy with school and business because it's December and a lot of a lot of my customer wants to order bulk for gift present so I've, I'm busy doing scrunchies with the help of my Lola slash grandmother and my ca two cousins um, my boyfriend also helped me <laughs> actually I I made a vlog last month and in the middle of editing it I realized I don't want to upload this because it's too short and a little bit tacky and I don't want to risk it, risk it. I don't want to upload vlog just for the sake of post, posting consistently. I don't want you guys to watch a poor, poor content, poor content. <laughs> so today's vlog is about shop update and me trying my new portable fabric cutting machine so, oh my gosh i'm so excited because my work will be a lot a lot easier and faster so so let's go Wow. Manual. Liha and oil. Is this oil? Or I might be wrong. <laughs> or it's a wax. It's heavy. At our garage this is where I will cut because we had a big table here if you're watching my vlog you know that I usually cut fabrics on at my room with my small table but now this is a different setup I'm cutting satin silk oversize six layers of Adam and six layers of Nico Now, this is soft velvet, medium fluffy scrunchy size, 4 colors, 2 layers each color. My other studio is a mess right now. I'm doing headbands again and gardening some medium fluffy scrunchies, satin silk fabric. 
here I had a lot of pre-made scrunchies also there that is soon by my grandmother so thank you Lola for helping me here are the samples for my new collection look at that it's so cute two-tone scrunchies and I also made a sample for ribbon clip this is where I put the dresses and here are my mermaid scrunchies uh, medium fluffy scrunchies near paint fabric um, mermaid scrunchies again headbands and threads by the way I have two new organizers that is just DIY made out of box as you can see hi Mara. I I still don't have a budget to buy organizers because I'm prioritizing to buy a lot more fabrics. It's raining. So this is cappuccino, one roll of fabric. This is one of my best sellers. So let's open it. Another roll of fabric. This is also one of my best seller, Baraco from Coffee Collection. This will be delivered to my grandmother because she will help me in terms of sewing, and I'm gonna do the other process like putting the garter and Hola. hi 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 <laughs> here i'm sewing the headband Hi. To my vlog. Hi
I will flip this now. These are new colors in my headbands because as I remember I only have 15. So yeah, so my customers will have more options. I still don't know how many colors is this. I will count later. I want to tell you something while I flip this. Look, I have many people here, but don't mind it. So, where are we? Oh, you guys comment how much do I sell my scrunchies? And I replied, I said 27 from 27 pesos to 100 plus pesos. And you guys think it's expensive, but for me, it's actually not because it's pesos not dollars so if you convert it from pesos to dollars it ranges from 0 0.5 to two dollars but if i would sell internationally the price is much higher because the platform to sell internationally have more fees and like what i've used now shopee and shopbox so shopee is like Etsy and Shopbox so is like Shopify because you have your own website. By the way, guys, this is not sponsored. I just want to share it with you. Those two, you only pay if there's a transaction. No monthly subscription or listing fees like Etsy and Shopify. But I'm planning to increase my price because Shopee increased their transaction fee. And some of the materials I use also increase. So if you're my customer, please understand. Cardigan, a lot of fabric dust. I'm gonna do this while watching a small business vlog. Hi. Kanda. Hi. <laughs> Amara.
Hi! Before I discuss what is my agenda today, I want to share with you guys what is my nationality. So, I'm a Filipino but I speak English in my vlog. But that's because I noticed that a lot of my viewers and subscribers are from other countries. So when I start showing my face and speaking in my vlog, I decided to use English language so you can understand me. But in this vlog and to my upcoming vlog, I might speak some Filipino words. So, uh, <laughs> so, so it's... So it's a mix of English and Filipino words, you know, Taglish. So some of my vlog is Taglish, mix of Tagalog and English. Because there are some things that I want to explain it in Filipino. I don't know how to explain it more, but yeah. <laughs> Please don't rush me if I use Taglish. I will put subtitles so you can still understand me. So this is my mother. Hello. We look so much alike. Wait, is that the right word? <laughs> so she also has a online business. So what do you sell? Um, I'm making my own design of pillowcases, bed sheets, and I started um, making show cover, and then I found out that I can make also pillowcases and bed sheets. And so, I have my page, Scissors and Cut, the home decor. You might want to check her business. I will put it down below. <laughs> but today, she, ha she has a job. So she has two jobs. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm going to drop some of the orders. And I'm making also um, mulberry uh, silk pillowcase. And uh, that's with zipper, so the pillow will not go out from the pillowcase. And yeah, that's all. And I'm available in Shopee and Lazada. My mom is so beautiful, right? <laughs> <laughs> so today I'm gonna make more ribbons. Then after that, I will cut the clip card. It would look like this. There are still no allocated clips, so I will just hold it. See? Then I will, I will also cut the handbags for scrunchies. This one is for oversized scrunchies. For mermaid scrunchies. And wait. For medium puppy scrunchies, I still don't have for large scrunchies. And that's for headband. And lastly, thank you, stickers. Sarah, 
말해줘 baby 네가 없더라도 난잘 살고 있다고 라고 말하지만 사실 널못 잊어 벌써 2년 전에 이별이었지만 여전히 아파 baby baby I owe you means I love you and nothing else will do baby I owe you oh yes I do an explanation baby I know you don't get what I'm saying cause I'm speaking a different language but I just want you to be here I posted this one in YouTube community and there's a comment if I can share my experience about this product. Disclaimer guys, I am not a professional or knowledgeable about this. What will I say is based on my experience and I will speak Taglish because I am more comfortable with it. First, I bought this for 2,799 pesos, 1 inch size. The size that I'm talking about is this one. Kung gano'ng kakapal yung kaya niya. So, ito kaya niya ay 1 inch. Merong ibang sizes like na like 2.5 inches up to 7 inches. But, ito muna yung binili ko kasi hindi pa naman ganun kakapal yung kinakat ko. May tatlo siyang gulong sa ilalim. Para it's easier for you to slide it when cutting. But I find it hard sa mga curve lines. Expect that this is very loud or noisy because it is a machine. I will turn it on so you can know what I meant. This cutting machine really helped me because I cut in bulk. Naglalaan talaga ako ng 1 to 2 days just for cutting. Almost all of kind all kinds of fabric and colors. Kinakat ko yun sabay-sabay. If you already watching my vlogs, you know that I only use scissors and cut 1 to 3 colors at a time. And minsan tinotofi ko pa siya talaga sa pinakamaliit para lang mabilis akong mag-cut. But after a while, napapansin ko sumasakit na talaga yung wrist ko and kamay ko. So, my mother and grandmother suggest na to buy fabric cutting machine. Is it worth it? Yes, it's worth it. Almost all of the garments industries use fabric cutting machine. Imagine, I have 27 colors in satin. From cutting 1 to, to 3 colors... At a time, I can now cut up to 27 layers and hindi pa yun almost 1 inch. So, I will experiment how many layers this fabric cutting machine can. Before I end this vlog, there's another comment. He wanted a shout out. Shout out to Newton Nagal Vlog. I don't know if I pronounced it correct. And I don't know you personally, but thank you for watching my vlog. I saw that he's also posting about business and daily vlog. So that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a good day. And Amara will say bye to you. Bye. Bye, bye baby. Bye. <laughs>